Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all well. I hope you're doing good. If you're new then hi, welcome to my channel. Love it if you could stick around and hit subscribe. It would literally mean the world to me. Today we're just going to get straight on into it. Today we are testing and trying Zaffle. If I'm honest I've never bought from Zaffle before so all of these opinions and stuff like that will be my very first impressions of Zaful and I do just want to start this video by saying a massive thank you to Zaful for gifting me all of these items but like I say all of my opinions will be my very own. So without further ado let's just get straight on into it. first item and how cute literally how cute so like I normally always say um everything will be linked down below if you are interested in buying sorry guys I also completely forgot to say Zaffle have also kind of given me a discount code for 18% off which will be left on screen now but how cute is this little bag it's so adorable it's just got this like it's quite like a cute little like shoulder bag like so i just thought it was so cute and i just love my kind of nudie colors at the moment when i saw it i was like i just have to have that it's like this kind of faux kind of croc kind of skin type effect on it and it's just like a really cute nude color like i say you could literally wear it like this it fits really really nicely it's quite big as well you can definitely fit quite a few bits in there oh what's in there paper it's actually like quite a big i don't know how well you're seeing that but it's actually quite a big kind of bag as well for kind of like a mini bag so that's really cute and if not you can just kind of hold it like so or like so i don't know i just thought this would be a nice item to start with i don't really show bags and stuff like that on my channel that often if that's something you want to see more of let me know and i can obviously do so um also excuse my nails they are being done tomorrow now Boris has said that I can go get my nails done. Best believe that was the first appointment I made come 9am on Wednesday. Yeah, just a nice kind of accessory piece for all those trips out I'm now going to be doing. Okay, this next piece I have tried on. I'm not going to lie because um, like I say now lockdown restrictions are kind of been taken down a tad. I am off out this weekend. Um just for a nice day trip to London, which I'm so excited about. Um, I'll literally be there when you're watching this, so like, it's so exciting. I tried this on just to see if this was kind of gonna be my vibe, and I think it is gonna be my vibe. So this is the next thing I picked up, and it's just this kind of like chocolatey brown kind of dress. It's, I'm gonna have to show you this on because I just don't feel like it not on is gonna do it much justice. There's so much stretch to this, it's like ruched down the edges. You can have this as long or as short as you like preferably i do prefer it a little bit shorter um but it does go down to like a midi dress as well but it's like this kind of like small ribbed detailing again i don't know how well you're going to be seeing that again excuse the nails um but i just thought this was really really cute i'm going to team this with like a oversized kind of trenchy coat type vibe if you know what i mean um I just thought it was really really cute really flattering again there's so much stretch to it again you can have it kind of as long or short as you want but I will show you this on because I don't think it my body is going to do it much justice <laughs> I just forgot but sizes and stuff will also be linked down below next to the link as well I've just remembered because I just looked at this the sizing of this because I was like I swear I ordered that oversized um and it's actually tiny so I ordered this blazer shock can we do a Lauren Cook video without a blazer it's just like at the moment it's just not a thing like blazers are in every freaking hole um but yeah i was a bit sad about this one because i ordered this in an extra large wanting it to be super oversized so i could wear it as like a blazer dress type 
situation. Yeah. I ordered it in an extra large and I kid you not, this could probably pass for a small. Um, so just bear that in mind. Obviously, I'll show you what it looks like on me when I'm trying it on. It's super, super short. Like, I tried it on as a dress and everything was hanging out. Honestly, you could not get away with it as a dress. It's got the pockets are real, which I really love. Um, but yeah, I am just a bit upset that unfortunately it is just not as oversized. I Like I said, I will show you in the try on clip. Um, yeah, like literally look i did pick up the extra large but i kid you not it could pass for a small maybe even an extra small so just bear that in mind when picking up this item oh i like that a lot hmm love that what can i wear this with i don't know what i'd wear on the bottoms if i wore white i don't think black would go that would be a lot of colors um but we'll have a look maybe some cream pants yeah that would go maybe bags are that they come in so i picked up another bag and again this was a bit of a catfish item i didn't expect it to be so small it's just a brown bag please it looks a lot bigger on camera and i kid you not it's actually like it's probably about the same size as my head um it's actually quite small but i thought it was really really cute i guess if you're on holiday just pop pop in your purse um it's quite a nice length actually let me show you it kind of comes down towards the hips so it's not too long it's actually really really cute but this is for a holiday you could fit your purse in it you might be able to fit like a very small kind of compact camera in there um does my phone fit in so i've got the eight plus i think phone kind of doesn't fit so maybe just bear that in mind as well if you wanted to put your phone in i don't usually put my phone in my bag anyway i normally have it in a pocket or in my hands um but i just thought this was really really cute it is super cute but like i say it's a bit of a catfish item just because i did think it was going to be a lot bigger um because of the pictures but nevertheless it's really cute it'll make a cute little holiday bag and i don't think there's a lot more to say about the actual bag itself just a cute little bag um these need a iron so badly again this item is another little blazer again what size did i pick it up in oh, i went for eight i went for a small in this one um so i was clearly just thinking of having it as a normal blazer this is very very thin material i don't know what type of material it is it's like woven it's a bit like linen actually it's like it's a lot like linen um does it say on the label pockets real let's do a test no it is just literally like a flap um but nevertheless i think it's quite cute this again with maybe like a white roll neck you i could wear black trousers with this so that is really really good um it's just very very standard i personally would feel very cold in this weather at the moment with just this and a jumper so i would then probably match it with a duster coat on top as well just an fyi because it is literally like super super thin but it is really really cute and i'll just try it on for you because again it's not doing it much justice with me just holding it up
this next item if you follow me on Instagram. If you don't, why not? I will leave it here on screen. Go follow me. If you follow me on Instagram, you would have already seen this item. And it's just this kind of bandeau type top. When I ordered this, I ordered it in, gr in grey. But it's come in this kind of like sagey green colour. Which I'm not going to lie, I'm absolutely digging. I probably do prefer it much more than the actual grey colour that I picked. So that is a bonus, but just bear that in mind when you are buying this item, that the grey is more of like a khaki, very light khaki sage greeny type colour. Just this nice knitted material. I have paired this with joggers in my Instagram picture. I'll leave it here on screen. Maybe go like it. Also dress this up, pair this with like a nice pair of leather trousers and Bob's your uncle, Fanny's your aunt, and you've got a nice versatile piece type thing here you could also wear this like under blazers anything like that personally i wouldn't wear this like out out just because it's like a knitted material i think knitted material is more kind of loungy but i think this is so cute and it's kind of got that kind of sweetheart type what is it it's not a neckline because your neck's here and this is down here but do you know what i mean it's kind of got that sweetheart shape to it which is absolutely gorgeous um so yeah, I love this piece so much. This was such a good buy from me. I'm gonna get so much wear out of this. My last item that I have got to show you guys is just this cute little bodysuit. It's just in this kind of stony beige colour. I love stuff like this. I just think, like I said with the last piece, so easy to dress this up with and it's so easy just to wear lounging around the house. Again, probably would just wear this lounging around the house opposed to wearing it out. But again, you can wear this as risky or as non-risky as you like. Um, so if you have a nice cleavage, not that I do, so I would probably just be having them done all the way up to the neck. If you did have a nice cleavage, you could get your cleavage out with the poppers. I just think this is so cute. It's just such a nice piece. I had something very similar in like a lilac colour in the summer and I'm obsessed with this colour at the moment. So this was just a nice little piece that I just had to pick up. I don't know, there's not a lot to say about it. It's just this really nice kind of rib material again. Um, and like I said, I'd probably just pair this with tracksuit bottoms or if I was going to dress it up, maybe like leather leggings again. Um, or oh, this with some nice plazo trousers, like white plazo trousers. Then you could wear it out actually. That would be quite cute. Um, but yeah, that's the last item. So I'll try this on for you now. does bring me to the end of today's video i really hope you have enjoyed again that was all my first impressions of zaffle the only thing i would say about zaffle is just be very careful with the sizes that you pick up because like i say that extra large was nowhere near an extra large at all just be very cautious on the sizing but that's all i really had bad to say about it hopefully you have liked this video if you want me to test and try anything else from zaffle please do let me know and i can do so whether that's coats i know a lot of people have said that they like me trying on coats from shein just so they get a feel of kind of that type of thing but let me know let me know and i can definitely do that for you guys again a massive thank you to zaffle for gifting me all of the items in this video it is very much appreciated but without further ado i will end today's video if you have liked me and you like the content that i create like i say i do a lot of testing and trying i do a lot of hauls stuff like that and it's christmas at the moment so hopefully a lot more christmasy type vlogs are going to be coming however i am working again so please bear with me on the content please do subscribe please do like this video i don't know what it does but it really does help my channel and 
it means the world it really really does so thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in next week's video bye